Hello, hello, hello. Let me make sure this recording is going. Yes, we're looking good there. Welcome to day two of Getting Started with Canvas. My name is Jamie Orr, and I'd like to know who you are, who's hanging out with me today. Give me some sevens in the chat box and let me know who you are, where you're from, your first kid's middle name, your driver's license number, social security, and all the other good stuff. Let's put it in the chat box and let's get this started. Give me some sevens. Let me know what's going on out there. Alexander, what's happening? Jim, what is going on? Randy, yeah, Jim, I saw you. I got your stuff. Randy, what's happening? Sean, Larry in Dallas, what's going on? William, chicka tea, chicka 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 tea. All right, Perry, Lynn, Kathleen, Anthony, Larry, where else? Chase, Michigan, says John. Are you guys freezing up there or what, man, John? It's cold all over the East. Actually, today in Virginia, it's actually not that bad. We actually told the kids, get out there and walk today. Come on, let's go. Get away from those screens. Dean Busey, what's going on, man? Martin says loud and clear. CJ, what's happening, buddy? Aaron, man, this thing is just flying. You see all this, Charles? Woo! Man, dirt. It's unbelievable, baby. Yeah, Thomas in Oregon, what's going on? What part of Oregon you in, Thomas? Glenna, there's my Glenna in Houston. Royal in Atlanta, Georgia, right next to my buddy Charles. 777 Stoke-on-Trent, UK. Enough? What does that mean, Steve? Stoke-on-Trent. I don't know what that means, man. Let's see here. Kathleen, everybody, Los Angeles, David Swain, Virginia. We're about to Virginia. Arnie, that's Arnie, Okay. Awesome. Wow. This place is packed again today. Jim Boxley's in the house. Say hello to my daughter, Melanie. Melanie, what are you up to? What is going on with Melanie? Melanie, how old are you? You are on a webinar today, Melanie, and I'm excited to have you. Let me see here. Let me see if I can find out. How old's Melanie, Malcolm? Let's see here. Uh, uh, now I'm going to stop the whole webinar for Melanie. <laughs> Ah, oh my gosh, that's so funny. 40. Oh, okay, Melanie's 40. What's going on, Melanie? That's awesome. Well, glad you joined us today. Uh, Stoke on Trent is a city. I got you, Arlen. That's cool. Sheffield, UK. Wow, Great Lakes. Everybody. Max from Portugal, Indiana. Everybody's here. Hershey, Pennsylvania. Let's go get some chocolate. All right. We're stopping the webinar right now, and I need some sevens for who loves chocolate. Give me some sevens for who loves chocolate. Come on. Who's my chocolate lovers? I need to see it. You know it. <laughs> well, everybody, we're going to get started here. I have a bunch of questions to ask everybody. And uh, before we get going, I just want to just introduce you to somebody that's going to join us today. Uh, this is a gentleman that I uh, got to know uh, just the past over the past six months or so because he's a part of the Dropbox family here. But in September, we actually got to spend some time together down in Orlando. And uh, it's just a, a great guy. He's got a wealth of knowledge when it comes to the local businesses and, and working with local businesses. He's got a very successful local business in the Atlanta market. I want to introduce you guys, and I want you to give them a warm welcome. Give them some sevens. This is Charles Edge. Give everybody a hello, Charles. Hey, 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 hey. <laughs> Appreciate the intro, Jamie. <laughs> this is going to be a fun day today, no doubt. A lot of you information. To, are you ready to give some gems, man, or what? Dude, it's all about the gems, baby. Yes, awesome. Doesn't he sound like, like a radio announcer guy? He was singing some barbershop quartet stuff for me before we started this thing. So we're going to have some fun today, and uh, we have an echo. Okay, so what that is is, Charles, whenever I'm, I'm going on, there is a little echo if you'll mute, and then whenever I, I call you, if you'll just unmute, uh, they're hearing a little bit of an echo, and that's probably where it's coming from. All right, perfect. All right, so let's do this. Okay, I need to – we have – it's jam-packed again today, just like yesterday, which is fantastic. I need to know my audience of where we're at because that's going to dictate how today's going to go. I have two, basically, uh, uh, avenues that I'm going to go down today, and it's based off of you guys and where we're at. So how many people were on the webinar yesterday? Give me a 777 in the chat box. And if you were not on the webinar yesterday, and this is your first one, give me a 222. 777 if you were, and a 222 if you were not. 
Okay, everybody, 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 everybody. Seven, seven. Okay, David was not okay. Seven, 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 seven. Okay, okay, okay. Oh, well, there's a lot of two, two, twos, two, two, twos, two, two, twos, two, two, two. Okay, so hmm, it doesn't look like it's fifty. It might be fifty, fifty. I don't know. It's close. All right. <laughs> so what I'm gonna do <clears throat> is there's a lot of on call for day job, Jim. All right, buddy. Have them watch the replay. Yeah, that definitely we have the replay uh, from yesterday. You will get that as well. It's jam packed. It was it was actually a marathon session. I I got off of there and I realized, holy cow, two hours and fifteen hours, twenty minutes. I had no idea. I just got going. So today we're gonna do something. I want to kind of go over the basics just real quick again for all the newcomers that have joined us, and then we're gonna really get into building your business, making sales, uh, generating referrals. Charles has got some a wealth of experience that he's going to share with you today on uh, just getting your business up and running and some some strategies that he uses to really get um, a foothold in the local market. He's got a secret that he's going to share with you today that I'm really excited uh, excited about that he's going to share with you. Uh, so we're going to get into all that, but I want to start off with the basics again. Real quick, so we're all on the same page here, okay? And those of you that were with me yesterday, just kind of just kind of bear with, with us here in the initial phase so we can get through this, okay? We're all friends here. We're all family. We're going to do this. As you know, most of you came on board uh, as a new customer with Canvas, okay? It's an amazing tool that is a first-to-market opportunity. But when you log in, you log into this website called Dropmock, and you're like, what the heck is going on here? I bought Canvas and I'm logging in to Dropmock and I want to explain that to you. You see, Dropmock is a company started by Lee Pennington uh, a few years ago now. Lee Pennington is the owner and founder um, and he's he's uh, now the CEO of Viral, a, uh, a dominant cryptocurrency uh, out there in the crypto world. And just a couple months ago, he's uh, he brought me on board uh, basically April, March, April of uh, 2017 and uh, just a couple months ago, he uh, promoted me up to the position of CEO here at Dropmock as he's, uh, you know, really taking the cryptocurrency world by storm. Well, he started Dropmock, and as he started developing other softwares, he realized that the customers, all of our customers, needed one login, username, and password. Instead of having to go to, you know, five different platforms, log into Dropmock, and you're able to access all of our softwares. So inside of Dropmock, you're going to see our mock-up engine where you can mock up photos, videos, and scenes. Then you'll see Pitch, which is our Facebook ads creator. You'll also see Kinetic, which is our video commercials, where you can create professional-grade videos for websites, social media, and all that. And then Canvas is our Facebook video header creator. Okay, so hopefully that explains it a little bit to you in regards to what's going on. Now, those of you that are customers of Kinetic, when you log in, you're still going to see your Kinetic button. You just need to click on your Kinetic button to get into the Canvas area. And I'm going to show you that in just a second. Okay. And I just wanted to just describe that to you and show you the dashboard real quick so you understand what I'm talking about. So you'll see when you log into Dropmock, you'll see image, video, and scene. All of this is part of our mock up engine where you can mock up different images and videos and scenes. Pitch. Those are Facebook video ads, um, and they're about 15 seconds each. Really, really powerful tool. And then those of you that are just Canvas customers are going to see Canvas. Now, those of you that are Kinetic customers, this is so important because this is causing a little bit of confusion for our, our Kinetic customers. And I'm going to explain that in a little bit more detail today because it's really, really important. Uh, so you guys that are Kinetic customers uh, really understand what we've done here because it's uh, it's pretty powerful overall. Uh, let me log in. Like I'm gonna log in as admin real quick to kind of change something around so you can see it. And you'll see in just a second here. All right. And give me one second as I do this. All right, so now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna change my personal account over to a Kinetic account as well. Just like those of you that are currently Kinetic users. All right. So those of you that aren't, you saw Canvas, just like you just saw with mine. It was, uh, yeah, it was just said Canvas on it, right? All right. So now my account that I'm going to upgrade right now in the admin area, 
I'm going to go ahead and do this and I'm going to edit the user. And I know you guys can't see this right now. Um, okay, and I'm going to go like this and I'm going to go like this. I, I'm sorry you can't see this. This is kind of like the back of the house stuff in the admin area. <laughs> this is the wizard behind the curtain. What's the song? What's the Wizard of Oz song? Uh, because, 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 no, the wonderful thing she does. No, that's not it. What is, um, I don't know. The Yellow Brick Road. That's the one I'm thinking of. All right, now let me log back in as myself. All right, now you're going to see, when I log back in as myself, I have Kinetic now. You see that? Remember how this said Canvas initially? All right, so now I log in because I'm a Kinetic and Canvas user. I click on Kinetic, all right? And what's going to happen is it takes me into the Kinetic system, the infrastructure, the power behind the technology. And inside here, we have HD by Kinetic, which is our video commercials that are HD, okay? The uh, 1280 by 720. It's a high quality video commercial. Canvas by Kinetic is a Facebook video header at a different dimension, exclusively for Facebook, okay? Which is 820 by 464. Now, those of you that want, that are Kinetic customers that want to just use Canvas, or just use Kinetic. You come in here, you click on Kinetic, HD by Kinetic, click Filters, HD by Kinetic, click Apply. And all you're going to see is HD by Kinetic. See that? All the templates are HD by Kinetic. Those of you that are that are Kinetic customers that want to use Canvas, click on Filter, Canvas by Kinetic, click Apply. See that? Canvas by Kinetic, Canvas by Kinetic, Canvas by Kinetic, Canvas by Kinetic. Let me explain this to you. You cannot use kinetic, HD by Kinetic on Facebook video headers. The dimensions don't work. That being said, sidebar, there are a couple HD by Kinetic templates. Just for some odd reason, they, they work on Facebook headers. Not all of them. They're not created for that. The size is not right. But for whatever reason, they just work, okay? Only a couple of them. That's the separation. You cannot use HD by Kinetic on Facebook video headers because Facebook's dimensions for the video header is not the correct one. Canvas by Kinetic is exclusively made for Facebook video headers. That's the power in this tool. It's made, we're approved by Facebook. Our app is approved by Facebook. We are set for you guys to be able to set these on your Facebook business pages, but you have to use Canvas by Kinetic. OK, so hopefully that really clears it up for our Kinetic customers, because just over the past couple of days, we really got a couple, a lot of uh, support questions about that. Hey, I keep trying to upload my video to Facebook and it says my size isn't correct. So Facebook is literally saying you're uploading the wrong size. And that's because HD by Kinetic is not the right size. That's the that's the issue with that. OK, or the challenge, I should say. So that being said. Let's move on to, I want to introduce you guys to the team real quick. And all of you that were on yesterday already uh, got to meet the team. But I want to just share with you what you have uh, here at your fingertips. We're a family, okay? We work together every single day to bring you these software programs, all right? From our support team at Martin, we have Abby, Chris, and Arlene. The ladies handle so much work. It's unbelievable from design to handling our videographers, our photographers. Every single month we go out there and we have a team of video uh, professionals and photo professionals that capture video, capture photos for you and for all, all of our scenes. Arlene and Deepak, they handle all of our testing of everything. Jeff, Ferdinand, Lawrence, and Rafi, they're creating all the video templates, all the design of all the video content come from these guys, Amr and Karim, Karim is our lead programmer. He's got a team of people that work with him um, in Egypt to help create all of this spectacular technology. And then Charles Edge, who is on the call today, who helps us with our webinars, our white label software, with all of our sales. And he brings a wealth of, of successful business experience in the local market to you today. And I'm so happy that Charles is able to join us today because he's really going to be able to share with you a wealth of knowledge. So those of you that are utilizing Canvas and, um, you know, you're in there and, and making things happen, I want you to understand that you have a team behind you. This is your team. 
And I want you to present us as your team. So when you're talking to people, when you're talking to your clients, when you're talking to potential clients, let them know that you have a team of people behind you, okay? Most of you know that I'm in in the I'm really really big in the real estate video niche, okay? That's what I've been doing since 2005. Um all of the people that work with me, whether they're in California, Pennsylvania, uh Tennessee, North Carolina, it doesn't matter, wherever they're at, Virginia, wherever they're working with me, they they tell their real estate agents, my team in Virginia handles all of that technical stuff. My team in Virginia handles all that video stuff. You see, they don't do the work. They hire the work out to my team here in Virginia to handle their real estate videos, their social media, and all that stuff. They're presenting themselves in Philadelphia as this cutting edge, leading cutting edge real estate video social media company, but they're just a marketing company that uses my company. So same here. You're a marketing agency that now is has a family of people behind you. And I want you to use that to your benefit. You're not lying. We are here to support you. You have support. You have uh, a programmers. You have testers. You have people on your side. So when you're selling some, a Canvas video header and they say to you, well, what video editing program do you use? You say, I don't know. My, my team back at the, the office, they take care of that because we do. We take care of that. They don't need to know any of that. You're not lying to them. They don't need to know the secret sauce. And I'll be honest with you. I've never had a customer ask me, well, how do you do the editing? Unless they are an editor. If they're an editor, they're not going to be your client in the first place because they know how to do it. And I'll tell you what, they know how to do it better than you. And they'll tell you that. <laughs> Oh man. And just real quick, I'm going to do this really, really, really quick. Um, this is me and my family. My name is Jamie Oler. I'm now the CEO of Dropmock. I basically, uh, I work with, I coach people. I, I work in the real estate business, video business, small businesses. And now as the CEO of Dropmock, my job literally, and I take this very serious. My job is to make sure this software is, is amazing for you. But my job ultimately is to help your business succeed with our tools. That's it. And I have a customer service commitment that's really, really high, okay? Um, yes, are we not meeting that expectation right now? I'm always gonna be transparent with you. Right now, we are not meeting that expectation because we're still just a little bit behind with support tickets. And guess what? I'm in support helping out right now so we can catch up. Okay, because this launch was so massive, we have so many people asking questions and how do you do this and how do you do that? Well, this didn't work at this time. How many renders and all those questions that you guys have, which we're going to address today. That's my job is to make sure of it. Okay, and I'm going to give you a quick story. Actually, hold on one second. I got to the sun is just shining right in my face right now. Let me just close this curtain real quick here. That sun is just blaring in my face. That's right. We have sun in Virginia today. It's like 50 or 55 degrees. It's like heaven. But um, here's the deal. I'm going to tell you a quick story um, about one-on-one -on -one and GoDaddy. Now, all of you know that GoDaddy is something special. They've always, always have set a standard for customer service. It's always been like that. So I have servers with GoDaddy. I have servers with one-on-one. -on -one, and... I have my servers with one-on-one -on -one for the first time and I'm trying to get some stuff done. And this is basically, and I don't know how to explain it other than it's a blank server and we have to go in and set it all up. And I know Charles, you know what I'm talking about. And my guy, he goes in there and he does all this. Well, we ran into some issues. So I contact one-on-one -on -one support and I'm like, Hey, you know, this is what's going on. You know, we need some help with this. And they basically said, well, that's your server. Your people have to handle that. Like, what are you talking about? What do you mean my team? We're asking you because it's your server. No, it's your server. Your team has to handle that. I don't, and I didn't understand that. I do now, but I didn't at the time. So I'm on the phone with GoDaddy and I'm like, hey, you know, I had to get servers over here one-on-one -on -one for some specific clients, what we're doing over here. And we're running into this issue. And the GoDaddy employee said to me, listen, I'm not supposed to do this but we've had people call us from one-on-one -on -one before and this is what we found works. And GoDaddy support people gave me the solution to one-on-one, -on what I needed to accomplish at one-on-one. -on -one. 
That is customer service. Somebody providing me the service that I need to accomplish something, even though it wasn't their product, that's above and beyond customer service. And that is my commitment to you and your company. We will, once we get through this, 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 the, the next couple of days, when we get really stable with support again, I'm telling you, you're, everything is going to be fantastic. And we are here to take care of you. If you have any issues, no doubt about that. Okay. So let's dive into how you get everything up and running real quick. I'm just going to go blast through this real quick because I know the majority of you were on here yesterday, but I want to show you your profile, your training, and I want to go over renders. All right. So here, what, here's what we're going to do. When you first get into Canvas, you want to come over here and in the top right corner, you see this little icon? You want to click here and click on training. See this training right here? And you can also get there from right here. Not sure what to start? Click here to check out our video tutorials. So whether you're here or here, it takes you to the same spot where every single piece of our training for all of our products are in one spot. You'll come down to Canvas and start watching these. Do this first, okay? Make sure you watch these trainings, all right? And then ask your questions from there. The other thing I wanna bring your attention to is in your profile right here, when you click on profile, you can come in here and you can see how many remaining renders you have for Canvas. Right now I have 95 remaining Canvas renders for this month, okay? Because my account is set up as Canvas Elite which we get 100 renders per month as a Canvas Elite. Don't worry about any of these credits or kinetic renders. If you're a Canvas customer, it does not matter. Those of you that see available credits and uh, there's a place for you to add a credit card, do not worry about this. You do not have to add a credit card to our system if you're a Canvas member. Only if you're a Dropmock customer do you ever have to add your credit card here. And you don't even have to add your credit card. You don't need to do that if you don't want to. It's not a big deal. The other thing I want to bring your attention to is Connect. This is really, really cool, guys. We've integrated with all of it. See this one right here, Connect? We're going to go in here. You're able to connect your Facebook. And you'll see um, I've already connected my Facebook. I did that yesterday. You can connect your Uzine if you're a Uzine member. Your Instagram account, if you want to pull uh, photos and video in from your uh, Instagram account. Designo Pro 2, if you want to pull your content in from Designo Pro 2, YouTube. We're integrated with all of these. Our app is approved from all, all of these companies. We are good to go here. You literally can upload your video that you do inside of Canvas right to Facebook. Let me show you. Let me go in here. And let me go to my videos right here. All right, so here's the one I did yesterday. Remember yesterday I did this video for Erica Sholsky for, uh, I believe it was Aaron up in uh, Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania. See this? I literally can click on Facebook right now, right here, upload to Facebook, and I can choose which account I want to post it to, okay? And let's go to 05 Global, okay? Title, and I'll do EXP Realty and description uh, video header, Okay. And all I have to do um, is basically just click share on Facebook, all right? Once I share it on Facebook, it's literally going to upload it. Right now, it's, it's uploading to Facebook for me right now. So I don't have to download this video and then upload it later on. All I need to do is go to Facebook once it's done rendering on Facebook or encoding. Then I can choose it as my video header. It simplifies the whole process. We, we went through the two weeks of corresponding with Facebook back and forth, back and forth, back and forth to get the approval that we needed for our app to work on Facebook for you guys to simplify your life. We are an approved app on Facebook now for you guys to do that. And it is spectacular. I absolutely love this piece of it because you don't have to download it and then upload it again. It's a one click, send it to your Facebook fan page and that's it. And it can be any fan page. So let me describe that to you. Remember how I just did that? Let me, let me bring it up. Let's just say, uh, I, I need to really outline this because I want you to really grasp this. Let's just say your client only wants to give you access for uh, a day or two so you can upload it. Your client gives you access to their fan page, okay? But as an admin, it'll show up here. 
you go ahead and click upload to their fan page. Boom, it uploads it for them. Then they can go ahead and kick you out of their fan page and it's uploaded. You don't have to go on to Facebook. You don't have to upload it to Facebook. It's already done for you. So this really simplifies the process for you to be able to upload to your client's fan page without them having you in their account and access to their account ongoing or whatever. They just allow you, you upload it, and then they delete you out and you're good to go. Give me a 777 in the chat box if you absolutely love that piece of this tool, right? Isn't that cool? Yeah, Perry says seven. Matt, Dorothy, Lynn, Charles, Aaron. There's my, my friend Aaron from Pittsburgh. There you are. I got you. Yes, yes, yes. I love it. That's It's a really, really cool piece of the software that simplifies everything for us. All right. So now let's go to renders. Renders, renders, renders. What are renders? <coughs> Excuse me. I'm going to mute real quick. Hold on one second. <laughs> Sorry about that. Let me uh, let me take it. I have ice cubes in my water today to make it nice and cold so my throat doesn't get all raspy on us, which I can hear it's already doing. All right. 20 renders for the main account. Let's go over that. Those of you that were with me yesterday, we all agreed that this was fair, but I want to go over with all the new people today. Because there's a lot of new people that, that really are trying to wrap their minds around this render thing. I'm going to start with the commercial license. Most everybody that came on to Canvas bought the commercial license. With the commercial license, literally, you have unlimited ability to sell those templates over and over and over again. Let me explain the significance of that. When you go to most major photo selling companies and video selling companies where you're trying to buy an asset like a video that you can use or a photo that you can use in a project the licensing rights for that most of the time is a one time license per end user so you can buy it for a client that you're going to create a project for that client and that's it if you want to use that photo or video again you have to go back to that site and buy it again okay so it's very significant that you understand on the main package of Canvas, which is now, uh, you know, you bought it for whatever you did, $30, $35, $36, $37, whatever you bought it at during the launch. Let's just say $37 for the sake of conversation. For $37, one time, you're able to come into Canvas now every single month over and over for years to come and use those 20 templates and sell them over and over and over again and never pay us another licensing fee. That's significant, especially for 37 bucks, okay? It's, it's huge, all right? Now, what we do, though, is we give you 20 renders where you're able to go in there and create 20 projects. I consider a render a project. So you go in there and you create a project for a chiropractor. You do some edits, you add some photos, you add some text, and you render it. Once you render it, it gives you your preview. Let me show you what I'm talking about. So for example, yesterday we created this one here with a dense template. I'm able to come here now and I'm able to watch this. You see this? I'm able to watch this video now and take a look at it. And I'm like, okay, I like this, but oh shoot, I spelled her name wrong or I, I, the wrong website address or whatever. What I'm able to do now is I'm able to come in here and I'm able to come in and I'm able to edit this template. I'm able to come in and do any edits that I want to this specific template now. Um, at, at any time, I can, I can edit this and I can click render video. Guess what? When I click render video, it doesn't charge you another render. Your edits are free on Canvas. Okay? So you, it's you, one project is one render. Your edits are free. So everybody asks about this preview. I want to preview my work. I want to preview my work. Okay. The way our system works is you have to put your assets in first, render it. Our system then compiles all that together into an MP4 video that you're able to preview now and then make any changes. Okay. Does that make sense to everybody? Give me some sevens in the chat box if everybody understands that. Yes, sir. Yes, 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 yes. Those of you who are saying the edit button disappears, you are absolutely right. It disappears after two days, which I think is, and I'm going to be honest with you, I think it's absurd. 
I think it's absolutely absurd. And I'm pushing to get that to at least seven days, but I'm pushing for 10 days. Okay. I, I'll give you guys an update over the next couple of days to a week. Uh, but I am getting, I am hopefully getting that changed. Um, I'm having some pushback on it, but uh, I am doing everything I can to make that happen because I think it's a vitally important piece. When you sell a client, that client's going to want to make some changes. And you need to be able to have that time frame to do that. So I'm going to do everything I can to make that happen for you. Um, so just give me a little bit of time, another couple of days, and I will get that edit button a little bit longer for you guys. Um, it's it's a decision that was made for Kinetic, and it was brought over to Canvas. And we just we need to make we just need to switch that. And uh, I'm just working with the programmers to make that happen for you uh, because it's vitally important for the success of the project for you, or the I should say the life of the project because when you first send it to the agent or the broker or the chiropractor by email or Facebook messenger, they might not get back to you for two days, right? And then they get back to you on day three and they say, I love it. Can you put uh, this logo up instead? You have to be able to go in there and make that edit. And I get it. And we're going to work on that for you. Okay. All right. Beautiful. Beautiful. I know I'm going through this kind of quick today, uh, but it's important that you understand. So last one, last one is render times. Render times on average during normal usage, hundreds of people using the system. Our render times are between three minutes and 10 minutes. Yesterday, while I was live, I did a video and I'm going to do another one today for one of you. I don't know who it's going to be and I don't know what city or whatever. Get ready because I'm going to be asking you. I'm going to do one live. It took the render five minutes live on the on the uh, webinar yesterday. Everybody on here, I had people time it, took five minutes, okay? During massive usage, which is what we had during launch, where you have thousands of people using it, of course, it's going to take longer. It gets backed up. The servers get backed up with all the content. So you just have to be patient when there's massive amount of usage. But on average, three to 10 minutes, which is a great average. And I'm just going to tell you, I use Final Cut. Okay, you guys, I told you this yesterday. See this down here, Final Cut Pro? Let me just bring it up real quick. I use Final Cut to edit videos, uh, real estate videos, brokerage videos, community tour videos, all of that. When I'm using Final Cut and I'm doing rendering and stabilization and all that stuff, literally, it, it'll take 10 minutes, 15 minutes, 20 minutes, depending on the size of the video, it takes forever to do that, okay? And it also depends on your machine. It just so happens that I have somewhat of fairly robust machine because I do a lot of editing, but this is the real deal. I'm in here in Final Cut on a consistent basis and it's loading up a little bit slow, maybe because of GoToWebinar or something, I don't know, but uh, um, this is real. If you were to do this in a real editing software, it's going to take you 10, 15, 20 minutes to render and encode and save your video, okay? So it's not, it's actually like magic that we can do it Look at this. This is what I'm talking about. This, this video, if I were to save this, it's going to take 10 or 12 minutes for me to go ahead and get this video. All right. So that's real. So you're able to create a professional grade video header without having to know how to use Final Cut, Adobe After Effects, Adobe Premiere, or whatever software program and still have the same render times. Okay. Yet during busy, busy, busy times, it is a little bit slower. Now, can we do something about that? Yes, I'm talking to the team about how we can remedy that moving forward. Okay, now, 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 now. Here's where we get into the fun stuff. Let me see, there's a lot of questions coming in. Uh, yep, uh, okay. Is it possible to upload your own audio? Yes, yep, yeah. Okay, we'll get into all those questions. Is yesterday's training still available? Yes, it will be. Uh, Data month, yeah, from the yeah, from each month. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Perfect. Which client won't ask for any? Every every true Frederick says, which client's not gonna ask for a change? Every client's gonna ask for a change. They want their own spin on it. Even if it's perfect, they're still gonna ask for a change. Yep, I got you. Yep, yep, yep. Okay, everybody's everybody's agreeing here. <laughs> Some customers take too long. Listen. I have I have I have literally two servers going on one and one right now. One is an old server, it's an old outdated server, and one is a really robust new server. And I'm telling you, this the the old server it keeps going down. 
and I'm working with one and one. I have their their main support people trying to help me and all this good stuff, but it just keeps going down. Every couple of days, it just shuts down. And my clients keep telling me, oh, we're going to leave you. We're going to leave you. And why are you doing this? And I, I keep telling them, remember over the past four months, I keep telling you, give me access to your domain so I can point you to my new servers. Well, now it's vitally important that you point your domain to my new server or it's going to go down again. Clients drag their feet. And we know that they just do. I remember how many of you guys build websites? Oh my goodness. Is that a pain getting content from your clients? It's unbelievable the the how much they drag it on. So I get it in regards to being able to make changes. <laughs> All right. So here's what I want to do. Now it's time to take action. Now it's time to dive into this baby. Now it's time to go up another level. I'm going to create a video on the fly right here in front of you for one of you. All right. Before I do, now I'm going to ask you to put in your city and state in a, in a niche here in just a second. But before I do, I want to go over a couple main points about Canvas that a lot of you ask. Text characters and changing colors. First and foremost, text characters. We know as a company that you're limited with our text characters on a lot of the templates. And some of them we've, we've done a good job on uh, really allowing you the freedom. But that's because of the way our templates are created. We have to make sure that uh, the, the text doesn't go over all the other design of that template. So it limits you. That being said, we have solutions that we are already implementing so you have more freedom with the text characters. Everybody give me a 777 in the chat box if you are excited that we are going to, we are already jumping all over that text character count. I get it. I have the same issue. I know Charles has the same issue. It is what it is right now. We just have to get through it and we are working on the solutions and you're going to love it. On top of that, changing the colors of the templates. Let's go in there real quick and take a quick peek. So we have all these templates in here, right? They're awesome. These are very creative, awesome. Let me go to Canvas, apply. These templates are great. So for example, I used this one yesterday, okay? As far as an example, this one's all green, okay? Right here, see this? It's all green, it's called Jaden, okay? Let me go to Real Estate 3, okay? Uh, up in Charlottesville. This is a client of ours up in Charlottesville, been working with us for years and years and years and years, okay? Um, and oh, that's so funny. Oh my goodness, I had no idea. Wow, that's so funny. So, all right, sidebar. <laughs> We're all human here. So Real Estate 3 just left their franchise of um, who they've been with for years and years and years, okay? And their colors have always been green. Always, always, always been green. Beautiful green. It was really nice. So I was telling everybody yesterday, I can use this green with Real Estate 3. And here I go to their website today and they've switched it to blue. That's so funny. That's just, it is what it is. So I would have to come to Simplifica and use this one. So let's go ahead and preview it. And you see, I would have to use this one. See the blue? So this would match my client. Okay. But the challenge is if I want to use Jaden, it's green and it doesn't match my client's blue, right? That's frustrating. You're like, oh, I want to use this one. It's so good. We have a solution. And we're working on it already. Basically, what we're doing is we're creating these templates with different color palettes. Blue, green, red, orange, yellow, all the different variations of colors that you can do. And you're going to be able to choose your template and then be able to choose your color palette to match your client. Okay, we have so many new updates coming out over the next 30, 60 days because of your feedback. Because you guys have been gracious enough to share with us your thoughts, your ideas, your creative juices on how to make this better, which I appreciate. We take that series and we talk about it and we're implementing those things right away. Um, yeah, does it take a little bit of time to make it happen? Sure it does, but we are working on it to make it happen for you. In the meantime, even though I love Jaden, I am gonna have to use Simplifica for Real Estate 3 because of the blue. Or Noia, right here, N-O-A. Not sure why Jeff called that Noia, but N-O-A. I'm not sure what that means, but uh, it is what it is, right? Okay, so now, I want to create a Facebook fan page video header. 
Before I do, I'm going to show you guys some headers that everybody shared with us yesterday. And then what we're going to do is we're going to bring Charles up and he's going to start educating you on business, sales, generating business, some little strategies that he wants. Who wants me to create a video header for them in their local market for a business that they can sell it to? Give me a city, a state, and a business type, a niche in the chat box. And I'm going to pick one out live right now. And let me get a piece of paper and a pen here so I can make sure I'm, I'm right. Piece of paper and pen. All right, let's see here. I'm going to go with, uh, let's see here. Where is Edge? Edge is coming, Thomas. He's 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 in the back. Edge, say hi to everybody again real quick. They miss you. Yo, yo, yo. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Hopefully uh, uh, we're not, we're not uh, echoing to that. Going. I'm trying to find a niche here. Okay. Here's something. I have no idea where this is at. Uh, Egan, what is MN? Is that Minneapolis, Minnesota? What is MN? Do you know, Charles, MN is, is that Maine? Minnesota. You Are you certain? Yeah, MN should be Minnesota. All right, George in Egan, Minnesota. Okay, and what? You want to do travel. Okay, George... In Egan, Minnesota, he wants to do travel. Okay, this is actually, it's going to be an easy one. All right. <clears throat> so right away, George, and everybody that's watching, first thing that I say is this. When I bring up Final Cut, okay, and I'm going to work on this, this real estate video. All right, this is, what's the address? 1981 Greg Court in Yardley, Pennsylvania. All right. For me to create a video for 1981 Greg Court, I need a few things. I need video content. I need photo content. I need music. I need voiceover. Okay. I need all of this stuff. I need all of these assets for me to be able to create this video for this home. All right. Makes sense. If I don't have photos or video or voiceover content or music, I can't make a video for 1981 Greg Court. Does that make sense to everybody? Give me a seven, seven, seven in the chat box. If everybody make, if the, if all of that makes sense to everybody, that I have to have the assets available to me to be able to create this video, right? Yes, makes total sense. When I'm getting ready to do a travel video for a travel company in Egan, Minnesota, I'm going to write Minnesota down or I'm going to forget it. Minnesota, right? Minnesota. <laughs> oh my goodness. And I homeschool my kids. Oh man. All right. So Minnesota, um, I have to have assets for that project. Okay. So anytime you're getting ready to do a project in canvas, you have to have the assets before you start the project. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to, I'm going to find a, a, a template first. Okay, and I'm literally going to use the travel template to make it easy on me. See this? Okay, let me preview it. Beautiful. Customize this video. I like it, so I'm going to use this. All right. Actually, I, I, I misstepped. Let me go back. I want to show you how you get your assets. This is my bad. Let me show you. So I'm going to come here, filter, canvas, apply. Go down here to travel. All right. You see this right here? It's 42 seconds. I need five images. So I'm going to write that down. Five images from the travel company and five text overlay. Those are the assets I need. Just like I was, if I was going to create this right now inside of Final Cut, I would say I need five images and five text overlays to bring into my Final Cut editor. Makes sense, right? Here's now, inside of Canvas, I need five images and five text overlay. So I click Use. And now I'm going to go to Facebook. And I'm all I'm going to do is I'm going to come up here and I'm going to type in Travel Agency. How do you spell it? E-A-G-A-N Minnesota. All right, travel agency, Egan, Minnesota. Then I'm going to mouse over here to pages. And all of the different 
travel companies in Egan, Minnesota are going to show up. And it looks like there's, there's not many. <laughs> Dreamcatcher. So I'm going to go to Dreamcatcher here. Dreamcatcher Travel in Egan, Minnesota. All right. So I'm going to look around real quick to see if I can I can make sure I have assets that I can use. So first off, I'm going to make sure, okay, I have a phone number, email, website. Perfect. That's good. I want to go to their website. Let's make sure. Oh, man, they need a new website. Right there you go, George. This this company needs a new website right away. Um, ooh. So let me just go to photos here. That is pretty bad. That's that, one of the was, worst I've seen. <laughs> <laughs> come on, Charles. All right, dream catcher travel. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to come over here and I'm going to create a folder. Dream catcher travel. And literally, guys, this is what I do. All right, so now I'm going to grab five images. This is their first one. That's actually really small. I'm not going to use that one. Okay, I'm going to come here and, oh, look at that one. Save image. And I'm going to go Dreamcatcher Travel. And I'm going to label this number one. One. All right. I'm going to look for some more. Uh, see if that one's bigger. No, that's small. I wonder why they got that small. Okay. This one looks kind of cool. I don't like that they're up and down, but we'll get, we'll deal with that. Okay. Let's do this one. Oh, look at that guy. I wonder how old that turtle is. You know, turtles can like live forever, I think. Hey, listen to this. I got a, I got a movie for you guys. Um, Okay. It's called, hold on one second here. Okay. It's called, I think it's called Menzo. Menzu. Uh, Maru. M-E-R-U. Anybody that wants a real life drama movie. So last night, um, my wife and I, for the first time in weeks, got to spend some time together. Just so much going on with a lot of different things. And those of you that are married with kids, you know exactly what I'm talking about. She said, hey, let's watch this. It's kind of a documentary type of movie, but it's it, it's it's real. And it's about this these rock climbers, mountain climbers that climbed or potentially climbed. I'm not going to give it away. This this mountain called Maru. If you guys are in on Netflix or Amazon, I don't know which one it was on. Go and watch that. It's really, really inspiring. Sorry about the sidebar, but uh, <laughs> you guys know me. All right, let's see here. Let's do uh, right here. Uh, I'm not going to use, okay, I'll use sandals. No, I'm not going to use, I don't want to just be case, just in case of like uh, infringement stuff, whatever. I'm not going to use that one. Okay, let's do five. Okay, so there's five images. I'm going to get one more just for the sake of having it. That's too small. I know that's too small. I'll get... Um, this is kind of cool. Save image and we'll go six. All right. So now I know I have my images. I'm ready to rock and roll with the travel company now. All right. So I want to customize this. I'm going to come over here and it says customize this video. Right away it says I can have up to 20 characters. All right. So I'm going to go dream catcher. Now I'm, I'm going to type in travel. I don't think it'll fit, but I'm going to type it in just to see. Okay, it did fit. Dream catcher travel. I'm going to click save. All right, now it says I need a, a photo by 820 by 312. All right, 820 by 312 is that whole palette there. You want to do everything you can to have a photo that's 820 by 312. Okay. If by chance I'm working with a, a company that doesn't have many photos, I can actually pull photos from here. So for example, uh, like this, I could use this photo for a travel company. I could literally use this one, but for the sake of this, I have something from their site. So I'm gonna come here, Dreamcatcher Travel. That's not gonna work, that's not gonna work, that's not gonna work. That potentially will work. That potentially will work, and that will as well. I'm just gonna click on it and just see if I can see the size, get info. Uh, 720 by 540. And it's going to stretch it a little bit. So it's going to be a little distorted. 960 by 640. I'm going to use that one. Actually, let me try this one again. 720 by 540. So I could use these, but they're going to look a little bit distorted. But I'm going to use number five for the sake of this one because I don't have the time to go in and edit right now. So I'm going to go five. Okay. And it's going to ask me to size it. I'm going to size it up here like that. 
I crop and create. Boom, that's simple. Now I move on to slide number two, okay? And slide number two, okay? It's saying I can do up to 17 characters. And uh, what do I wanna do? Let's see what they say. Travel is life. So I'm gonna use that, travel is life. I like it. Let's use what they have, the assets they have. Travel is life, save. 820 by 312 again. All right, now I know I'm gonna be pushing my boundaries a little bit on this, but I'm gonna try this one. Okay, uh, I like that, okay, it'll be fine. Or do I like that stuff better? No, I like this, I like that better. Okay, crop and create. Okay, let's go to the next one. Same thing, 820 by 312. Okay, one through 25, let's go back to their site. What else do they say? Uh, the world is your playground. Oh, I love that. The world is your playground, okay? Okay, look, that's too that's too much. See that X? Okay, the world is a playground. I love it. I'm gonna click save. Boom. You see how I accommodated for that? Okay, I don't have to say the world is uh, the play, the playground or whatever it said. I just switched it. The world is a playground, okay? Go here, go like this. And I've used what, five? Yeah, five and six. Let's do number four. Oh, look at that. And listen. I watched this movie last night and uh, both uh, Candace and I, we went ahead and checked off the fact that uh, we don't want a career as mountain climbers. <laughs> it's just not going to happen. It's definitely not for us. Whew. I don't, I, I just don't, I don't get it. But uh, some people are driven in other ways than, than all of us. All right. So this one here is one through 17 dream catcher travel. Uh, we specialize in cruises. Uh, Let's do high quality service. Let's let's try that high quality service. Um, customized vacation destination. I like mm, high knowledge agents, no service fees. I don't know much about the travel industry, guys. So I'm just, I have to kind of just look around a little bit here just to kind of see. Uh, member, network fully licensed, small in size, but big in customer service. Dream to pride itself on finding the perfect dream, perfect dream vacation. Let's see if, or let's just do dream vacation. Let's try that. Okay. See if that works. Dream vacation. Okay. That works. Capitalize that. Capitalize that. I understand everybody wants a dream vacation. So that makes sense to me. Now here's the issue. I don't have any 8, 820 by 312 images anymore from them, right? I have all these stand up ones. So let me see if. Let me just see if I can get this turtle in there. I don't know. See, I don't like that. It's it's not going to really, I don't know. That's kind of a cool turtle. Hmm. I don't know, but that doesn't articulate what I'm trying to say here. A turtle's not a dream vacation. Well, maybe it is for turtle lovers. <laughs> okay, let's, let's try, uh, this one might be. Let's try this one. Uh, you see the 812, let's try that and see what happens. That That's, a lot of people want to go snorkeling. I oh, 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 there's my mouse thingy. All right, let's try that, crop and create. Hey, Jamie, All right. uh, explain that little bitty tip that you just, that they just saw how you can resize the image. A lot of people don't know that uh, once the image is inside the editor that you can drag it and it will make it bigger or smaller to, to uh, enhance the image that you have. Yep. Here, I'll show you on this one here. So let's go one more time, see if we can find, uh, actually, you know what I'm going to do? I'm literally going to use one from, watch this. All right. Let me type in my caption. Uh, actually, I'm going to put their phone number in. What's their phone number? Uh, 651. There we go. And how many characters do we have on this one? 113. Let's just do the phone number. Let's see if we can do call. There it is. Bang. Click save. Okay. Now I'm going to add the asset. I'm literally going to use one from, let's try pixels. Uh, and I'm going to do this one. Okay. Now what I can do is on my mouse, I can, I can use my scroll button on my mouse and I can make that image. See how it goes in and out. You can resize it. So things fit inside of canvas inside of this blue area by rolling your mouse. Okay. Crop and create. Good, good call, Charles. 
And there it is, everybody. That's it. It's that simple. Give me a quick 777 if you feel like you could do exactly what I just did. Give me some sevens. 777. Come on, Arnold, Darren, Lynn, Paul, Ron Duvall. Yes, sir. Alan Parker, what's going on? Yes, I love it. Okay, now here's what I do from there. All I do is I say, you know what? I don't want to use this audio. I want different audio. So I click this button right here and I click add audio. I'm in the library now. I can upload my own audio right here. Bomb, bomb, bomb. If you do this, it has to be at least 10 meg and it should be no maximum of 90 seconds. Has to be MP3 format. You can upload your own, but make sure you follow this. Go back to the library. I'm going to listen to some music here. This is a travel one, so let's listen. I, I really like this business freedom, but you might not. Let's do free as a bird. Okay, I like that one. Mm, that's kind of cool. Um, I'm going to use that one. I haven't used this one, okay? Save this to my drive. Always, 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 times 10, always save this to your drive. Generate mock-up. Now you're, okay, all of my friends, all of my people that knew this was coming, start a stopwatch. Somebody start a stopwatch. Charles, if you can, somebody start a timer, go to Google, stopwatch thing or whatever. Let's see how long that takes. <laughs> Let's watch this render in action. Live, on, I'm, putting, I'm putting my company on the spot here. What's going on here? The, it has started to render right now. It's not 849, but <laughs> our, our internal clock is messed up. But uh, we'll see. And George, when this is done, um, I'm going to need you to send me your email. And we're going to go ahead and send this over to you. So you can send it to our dream catcher friends. Okay? And literally, I want you to give it to them. You can sell it to them for 97 bucks or whatever you want. But I'd give it to them. Just so you have... Uh, the ability to show other potential clients that you have a video up and ready to roll. All right, let me come again. I, I want you guys, I hopefully you guys started your timer. All right, so let me take a sip of water real quick because we're going to get into some nitty gritty right now because Charles Edge is coming on and I, I don't know if you're ready for the edge. Here we go, hold on one second. Okay, this video is going to render. And as soon as it's done, it's going to spit up a big green thing over here. It's going to say, you're ready to watch your video. And I have no idea how long it's going to take. It should take between three minutes and 10 minutes. And if it takes longer than that, I'm going to have a big old fat, juicy pie in the face. It is what it is. I'll take the pie. But I here's what I know. We've built a rock solid system. That's amazing. You just saw me create that thing on the fly. I have no idea where Egan, actually, we're going to look. Because I have no idea. Let's just see where Egan, <laughs> Minnesota is. Let's just see. How many of you have ever heard of Egan, Minnesota? I don't know where it's at. Let's just see. I, I don't know George. George doesn't know me. And he put that in there. And I literally, on the fly, created a travel company's video. Okay, it's just on the outskirts of Minneapolis. Okay. And if you want to stay at a, a good uh, hotel, uh, Quality Inn and Suites, <laughs> it's your hotel to stay at. <laughs> and they didn't pay me to advertise. I need to charge them. There's a lot of people on here. <laughs> okay, so let's move forward. Right, let's go back here and see when the render is going to be done. All right, we're not going to wait for the render to get done to bring on Charles. But what I want to do now is I, I really want to start um, – I really want to dive into building your business now, you know, creating a list of potential businesses, mapping out your plan, your initial contact, following up, getting the deal, getting referrals, selling your stuff. I want you to start off here with uh, Canvas. I really want you to, your mindset here. Some of you are looking at Canvas as your business. And if you are, that's great because maybe it's you're just getting started in online marketing, uh, local marketing, and that's fine. But those of you that have marketing agencies and have been at this for a while, I want you to look at Canvas as another tool in your arsenal. It's another tool in your tool chest that you can use as a foot in the door, a loss leader, a way to start the relationship with these businesses. And I want to keep this up just in case I want to make sure that 
we timed this thing. And I hope I hope I got my timers rolling here because it, it, it's going to work and it's going to be really good. So what I want to do now is I want to talk a little bit about all of this business stuff. And I want to bring Charles up. And Charles, as soon as as soon as the render happens, I'm going to get all excited and take over the webinar again real quick. But uh, <laughs> what I want to do is I want to bring you up and I want you first off, take just a couple minutes and just describe your local business, what you do in the Atlanta market, your history a little bit. Just take two or three minutes so they understand who you are and what you've accomplished over, over a, a decade or so in, in the local market. And then I want to dive into you sharing with them how you feel they should take steps. And I want you to share with them that secret gem that you shared with me on how to get new businesses involved. So ladies and gentlemen, do me a quick favor. Give me some sevens in the chat box. Charles Edge, take it over, my friend. Hey, 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 Jamie J. Glad to be here, guys. I mean, I'm sitting back here just uh, chuckling, man. I, I, I wish I had a tenth of the energy that that Jamie brings to these webinars, man. It is, it is amazing. I, I think that should be the next product. I, I, I'm going to do a Jamie thing right quick. Yeah, forgive me, but give me a 777 in the chat box. If you wish you could bottle the energy that Jamie brings to these webinars and sell that. <laughs> the heck with the Facebook banner, man. <laughs> give me a bottle of that for sure. Oh, Look, 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 look. My video's ready. I'm sorry, Charles. I have to take it over again real quick. Who's my timers? How long did that take? How long did that take? Did you see that render? Five minutes, five minutes, four minutes, 55 seconds, four minutes, 42 seconds, nine, four minutes, 42.9, five seconds, four minutes. Ladies and gentlemen, that was live. I, I can't, I can't fake that. I mean, just refresh and make sure. You fake there it, it is. You let's take it. a look. I'm sorry, Charles. Let's this let's do this real quick. This is let's fake go ahead and watch this and see what it looks like. This is let's fake just news. see what it looks like. Oh man, dream catcher travel. Okay, I like it. Oh, travel is life. I love it. Look at that. Beautiful. The world is a playground. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm actually pretty proud of this. George, are you liking it or what, dude? Dream vacation. I should have put vacations. Yeah, actually, yeah, I, should, I, can. I can go in there and edit it. That's right, baby. Call 651-452-0431. Okay. I'm going to pause for one second here. And I want to know how many of you are like, yeah, that is awesome. Give me the sevens. Let me see the sevens. If you know right now you feel confident that you can do this. Come on. Isn't that awesome? This is an amazing. It's called travel, G. J-I-E Ling. J Ling. This it's called travel. Okay. Uh, any one of you can go in there and do this. Okay. It's it's so simple. The the key point is to have your assets ready going into your project. If you do that. You can succeed with all of these templates, every one of them, okay? I, I just, I, I love this. I love this software. Every time I use it, it gets me more excited because each and every one of you on here right now, I'm telling you, you have a first to market advantage over every other agency in your market because all those other agencies, they have to hire Final Cut Pro experts, Adobe Premiere experts. They have to hire freelancers. They have to spend hundreds and hundreds of dollars to create these. How much did you invest in Canvas? 35 bucks, $37. Maybe you got Canvas Elite at $17 a month as well, right? Ladies and gentlemen, you have at your fingertips something that's going to change your business here in 2018. And I am so excited for you. So that being said, let's learn how to build a business with these and sell these babies. So Charles, go ahead and take it over again, man. All right, all right, Jamie. I, I, I that was amazing, man. Uh, doing things live uh, on a webinar. And somebody asked me uh, in the chat box. I was uh, helping out on that side. So somebody asked me, uh, were we live or is this a recording? <laughs> Man, I wish I could record something this live. <laughs> For sure. Um, but yeah, guys, just want to uh, take a quick, quick, I mean, a really quick minute. 
uh, to, to give you guys a little bit of my, my history, my background. Uh, some of you guys know me. I, I pop on from time to time uh, on the webinars to, to give a little bit of, of, of a business uh, acumen to you know, what we're doing here, because I hope that we're not, uh, majority of you are not hobbyists meaning that you go out and you, you buy stuff in, in order to put together a nice home video. And these are great transitions for that. that mind you, you will have the most stunning um, home video uh, for your next uh, family reunion using these tools. But I want to say majority of us are here to, to coin and make a dime, uh, a lot of dimes and uh, really a lot of dollars. So what we like to do is also wrap this into an understanding of how to build a business around these tools that that we're making for you. And that's really what, what we want to talk about on the second half of this. We wanted to take a little time out uh, to show you some of the things within the, the platform. As Jamie mentioned when he first got on about the tickets, you know, even though there were a lot of tickets, believe it or not, 85% of those tickets were because of lack of knowledge. Not necessarily anything wrong with the platform or anything like that it was just lack of knowledge so we wanted to have these webinars so that we could show you exactly how to do things how to maneuver around um uh, with the platform that we put together for you which i think is just stunning so just a brief one two three about me um i'm in the atlanta area as as uh, jamie mentioned and i've, I've been in business since 1999 I actually uh, started a um, it support firm back in 99 i bought a franchise uh, computer troubleshooters the name of the franchise that I bought back in 99. Uh, and I had before that been in um, technology management for several major companies, um, IBM, G Capital, um, Long Island Savings Bank, <laughs> any of my New York people around. Um, but yeah, so with that in building and being a real entrepreneur, a real business owner, surviving in business for as long as I have, it, it isn't luck. Uh, I'll hit you with a, a, a statistic, easy for me to say, that people- Say that five in, times fast. I know, right? People who go into business, um, most businesses fail. Matter of fact, the number is 80% of businesses fail within the first five years. So those of us who have made it beyond five years in business, kudos. But there's some troubling facts behind that. As the statistics also say, 80% of the businesses who are in business don't make it to 10 years. So being in business for a few going on 18 years, almost two decades, uh, I've racked up a bit of knowledge on, on dealing and working with, with the local business um, mantra. So here's where my, my expertise kind of comes in to try to help you guys in making money from this wonderfully low uh, priced software, <laughs> $37, that's just pretty. But anyway, now I'm gonna talk about that. You guys got off. So now let's talk about a little bit, how can we make our $37 back? Um, as Jamie just showed you, right then and there is, is a really cool method um, to start a business. I mean, a very part-time business. You can go through and Google five or six businesses uh, in your local area um, and then do a little legwork, see if they've got a Facebook page and go out and create what I call show me material. Uh, anybody from Missouri, <laughs> put a 777 in the chat box if you're from uh, Missouri, uh, because their tagline and the model of their state, and this is uh, Missouri and the USA, I know we have a lot of people from around the world. I think we have got over 450 people on this webinar right now. So. Uh, their motto is show me. So in this day and age, with the way the world works and, and people wanting things right now, uh, you convincing somebody to, to trust your services without giving them something first as proof of concept of your skills is almost unheard of, unless you're one of the big boys with the established names. So how do we little guys get and compete with these big, big dogs and in, in the marketplace? It's the show me strategy. So just doing a simple search in your in your area, getting their content from their website and putting it in a video just as quick as we did, which probably took you all of, well, with the render included, less than 30 minutes, right? 
less than 30 minutes. Now, what I would do to the end of it is put my contact information in it or my logo in it and send it to them and let them see what type of quality you're able to produce for them because it shows them right out of the bat that you're not some internet entity that no one knows. So by doing that, it puts their guard down because you went out on your own and they don't know that it only took 30 minutes. To the, to the rest of the world, what we do is hours of painstaking expertise. They don't understand that. And I, and I would suggest you not show them the back end. <laughs> Never. Well, you know, that's really an interesting point. And I wanna go back to what I shared earlier about our team. Our team is your team, okay? <clears throat> they don't need to know that it takes you 15 minutes, 20 minutes, 30 minutes to create this video header because you have Canvas. They, they, businesses don't really care. They just want the end result. They want the product. They want the, the video header on their Facebook fan page. That's what, that's all they're concerned with. They literally think that you are utilizing all these amazing tools and all this video editing software and you don't have to tell them anything. So it's very important that you understand that, that it's not, it's not up to you. And I know some of you, cause I used to be this way a lot. I'm a very, very loyal, honest, passionate, straight to the point, you know, uh, type of person. And I always felt guilty about stuff like that. And I always felt guilty about little things whenever it came to working with businesses, what I can and can't tell them, because I like to be very transparent. But I realized over time that, well, if they're not asking, why do I have to tell them that, you know, listen, I got this software for 37 bucks that I'm doing this for. You know, I don't have to tell them that information. I was actually uh, telling Charles beginning of this webinar, I'm like, don't go ahead. Don't bring 20 gems to this webinar. It'll overwhelm everybody. It'll overwhelm me. Just bring a handful of gems that make sense to, to where we're at right now. And let's share that today because the businesses don't need to know all of the, the nuts and bolts of behind the scenes with all of this stuff. Just know that they're going to get an outstanding product. How you do it is because you have a team of people behind you from here that uh, have created this amazing software and you go in there and create it in 15 minutes and you charge them 97, 197, 297, whatever you charge. And they don't need to know anything other different than that. Absolutely. Absolutely. So we have the the benefit of of knowledge on our side. And again, that's what makes a good business model is return on investment. Uh, anytime that you can get 100, 200, 300 percent mock up uh, on an item, then you're it's it's a go. Um, when you're at 50 percent markup, that's a little bit. It just depends on how much time it takes. Uh, at that point. So use those references. Um, 100, 200, 300% mock-up are good areas for your business. So we're talking about the amount of time that it would take. So if we were to break things down into, into factual numbers. So would everybody say $100 an hour is a good hourly rate? If you had to say, this is what I charge for my time. I charge X per hour and say that that X per hour is $100 an hour for my time. And then if I'm going to go into business, I need to be making at least $200 profit for the $100 hour that I'm putting in. So if we start using those metrics, we know how to then start pricing appropriately our creations. So that, that's one of the biggest topics that I hear from time to time is, well, what do I charge? Well, what do I charge? Because you're thinking, because I only paid $34 for the product, or I'm paying $17 a month, that I should be giving the, the populace this huge financial break because, hey, I got it. Uh, no, uh, absolutely not. Because guess how much that $1.49 soda you get from your local fast food restaurant cost. Any guess what that large soda from McDonald's cost McDonald's to produce? Go ahead and put some put some numbers in, in the uh, chat box. I got 30 cent, I got three cent, I got five cent, I got 16 cent, 
four set, seven set, two set. Those people who are putting in the below seven set for the cup, you're absolutely right. Yeah, I know when, when Candace and I had a deli in uh, Belfont, Pennsylvania, we uh, our, our hard cost for a large Pepsi with ice was nine cents. Absolutely. Nine cents. So what is the return on investment of nine and you're selling it for a buck 49? That's way over 100% mock-up. If I said 100% mock-up on nine cent, you get the 18 cent. <laughs> Who that's, sells? That's, why, that's why when you go out to Ruby Tuesday or, or you know, uh, I don't know, what's your, whatever your favorite restaurant is, and they're charging two seventy five for a soda, you're like, are you insane? <laughs> and it's a, you know, an eight-ounce cup. <laughs> yep. Absolutely. Absolutely. So, again, when we start building our business using these, please, please keep in mind of the level of skill it takes to produce this level of quality and use that as part of your, your cost. Even though you didn't spend that, you're in business to make money, not to be um, a, a philanthropist and give away your services. Because once you start doing that, it's a race to the bottom. Everybody know what that term means? Race to the bottom, meaning that you're going to go out and beat somebody else's prices because you didn't kind of pay the hardship it took to design what we've just given you. And when you do that, your neighbor says, well, if he's going to charge 49, I'm going to charge 48. Race to the bottom. We're not there with this. This is why this is such a wonderful, wonderful opportunity. You don't have to sell on price right now because pr producing these Facebook cover videos is still a hot, hot commodity. That's why you jump in as early as you jumped in and you guys are brilliant for doing so. So now let's not spoil the marketplace by going in too low because it only took you 30 minutes to produce it. So think of yourselves and what you want to charge per hour. And I would I love that hundred dollars <laughs> an hour for my time, because at some point, if you're not doing this full time, I'm hoping that you want to. And the only way that you can survive doing so is having a fair price point. So let me put something else into perspective for you. We all know the two major um, media outlets in the world, radio, TV. If anybody has ever looked after these resources to, to market on, you've called up your local radio station, or you've called up your local TV station, and you wanted to get a spot for your business. Now, I know this may not pertain to probably 95% of the people on this webinar, but what I wanna let you know is the cost associated with they're going to hit you with a per spot cost, and then that's what you pay every time the, the advertisement runs. But before you even get there, you have to pay production cost to produce the content that's going to run on the spot. And I can guarantee you for a 30 second or one minute spot, the production cost for radio and TV are going to start no less than $499. No less than $499 for a 30 second to one minute spot in production. Now, of course, TV is gonna be a little bit higher because you're adding video. And so what are we doing here? Adding video. So that's how you should be thinking about the value of your agency and your business. People who, who race to the bottom are not going to be in business long. You have to keep your prices high in order to pay for all the overhead, the marketing, all the things that you're doing. Like right now, you're on a webinar with us and we've been on it for about an hour or so, a little over an hour. If you say that in order for me to gain the knowledge that I need to be successful in this business, I had to spend this hour and a half with Jamie and Charles, that is equal to $150 out of your pocket even though this webinar is free, but it's $150 out of your pocket because why? You cannot reclaim this hour and a half that you spent with us. That goes into the pricing <laughs> of your solution to the public. Oh, that's good. That's really good, dude. So again, don't think that because it didn't cost you that much to produce it, that it should be cheap. Au contraire, bon ami. It shouldn't. 
because ooh, 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 fee, 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 fee. <laughs> <laughs> no doubt so so put a seven 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 in the chat box if that makes sense to you guys because i want us to set a stage here we're a family we're a community we have to look out for each other i cannot make a business of making facebook headers if one of you goes out start running facebook ads to build facebook covers for 29 dollars Oh, you have, no, you, no, no. Then you yeah. have literally just killed us all. <laughs> then he <laughs> says, I'll slap him. <laughs> <laughs> right, exactly. You've literally just killed us all. And you've made no money for your time with us. Because we're going to teach you the ins and outs, the tricks, the all the little, little tidbits that you can build a successful business right now because you're at the bleeding edge. And, and contrary to popular belief, there's enough room for us all. The world is huge. You know how many people on Facebook? How many businesses on Facebook? And if you could sell just 10 Facebook covers, video Facebook covers starting at $199, you've just, I can't even, was it 10,000 times your investment? Something like that. So, oh man, we're getting violent on here now. Doug says off with their heads. <laughs> Bob up in Maine is is gonna he's gonna be the backup for uh, people to for Denny when he's slapping them. Yeah, so we're all. I think you know this is a really really good point, Charles, and I appreciate this because I had a lot of people asking me yesterday about price, and I I I was sharing you know from my experience here in my local market, and I was sharing you know from you know our buddy out Ron Ron Duvall out in Los uh, Los Angeles there, kind of sharing his pricing and. And I was kind of sharing it from that perspective, but what you're what you're doing is you're building a foundation of belief within ourselves. And I yep. think that's more important than me just telling you, oh, charge $197. So I, I really that's what I'm talking about. Charles has these gems, man. This is really, really good stuff, man. Thank you. I appreciate it, man. I, and I just want to share this with, with the community because again, uh being in business for almost 18 years, of course, I went down the same pattern uh when I first started, and, and I call that 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 time frame in my life eating because I needed to eat. Uh, <laughs> and so when you're just at that entry level and you need to eat, you take a little less for what your true value is, okay? Because you need to eat. <laughs> it's human nature, got it. But once you've got a meal or two under your belt, you shouldn't take those things. The first few customers are should be your your big break customers, meaning those are the ones that you'll you'll relax your prices on, and never ever ever um, have a low price. Always have a high price. But you're as the business owner, you can discount that. Okay, you can always discount that. And from a tax purposes for all you tax nuts out there, it's better to to have a a price of $200 discount it down to $79 because the difference between the $200 and the $79 is a tax write off. Okay? That is a negative asset in your business. So all the money that you discounted is a tax write off at the end of the year versus you just charging $79. That's income. So, hey man, I I, I just I just give it all to you when I when I get on. So anyway, one thing I, I did want to show you guys real quick. I don't want to make this too long because I'm going to be back on here several times. Just keep your ears pierced out for uh, some 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 webinars that I'm going to do that are really going to help you guys from from building the back end of your business to get ready for the success. Here's a, another tip for you guys: getting ready for the success. You have to be prepared for the success that you're going to have before you have it. It's that old saying, dress for success for the job you want to have, not the one you're in. So what that means is you got to have a system on the back end that's going to be able to, one, sell these Facebook covers, two, deploy these Facebook covers to the customer, three, have them build a referral market for you, rinse and repeat. But all that stuff needs to be in place before you sell your first Facebook cover, because getting a customer to trust you twice after you messed up once, it's hard and expensive. 
So we're going to be talking about all the things that you need to put in place, at least the minimum things. I, I'm not saying that you have to be <laughs> you know, ready uh, to go out and be Fortune 500 tomorrow, but there are going to be some things that you're going to need to do up front before you start placing your Facebook ads. Because trust me, when you do, you're going to get some business. And I want you to be ready for that. Okay, so Jamie, can I share my screen for, for just a second? Because here's a real, real good gem that I was sharing with uh, Jamie as far as the local businesses are concerned. Now, I, I must admit that this is coming from a US centric um, knowledge base here. So let's see. I don't know if you guys can see my screen or not. Yep, we got you. All right, uh, you should see some city of Tucson. City of Tucson, Arizona. Okay, okay. As local business owners in the United States, every business has to register themselves if you're legal business, <laughs> legal business owners have to get a business license. So there is a government entity in every city, every county. No, no, no hold, on, hold on. Everybody thinks you live in Tucson. No, no, no. He's just using this as an example. Yes, I'm just using this as an example. I, I did a Google search and, I, and I'll get to what you see on the screen in just a second. So every business in the United States to be a legal business has to have a business license. So there is a government entity that issues business licenses for its registered businesses. OK, so not only do you have to have a business license, you've got to keep it, meaning you have to renew it every year. Here is a cool little gym. Most, not all, most business, government business entities allow you to come in and download a list of all the businesses that register weekly or quarterly. These are brand new businesses. Yeah, these are either brand new businesses that have just got their license this week or old businesses that have just renewed their licenses that week. OK, so you can come in. I just Googled uh, uh, this uh, and, and did. Uh, I think my search term was uh, business license download, I think is what I used to get here. And it pulled up the city of Tucson and right on their page here. I can click here weekly businesses license business licenses. And it, and it gives me a text file that I can save to my computer. All right. Which I did earlier. I'm just going to do it again because it's just a text file. So let me open up uh, this text file here. And here is all the business information for the businesses that registered in Tucson this week. OK, now I, I think there's more information in this. This is just what's showing in my uh, I guess if I pull this up in an Excel spreadsheet, it would actually show me more fields uh, in here. But this gives you the information of how you can go after the businesses that have just started, which is a really, really good place to be because they are the ones who really want and need uh, the most help from internet marketers and things of that nature, getting their business up and running. Now, again, most of these things are free. There are some that will charge you. And the, the, the price may be $49, $59 to get that list. Uh, but like I said, all you have to do is Google. So I'm going to go in here and say uh, that is so, so good business licenses. Like I said, I'm in Georgia. And it's going to uh, take me to places where I can apply for the business license. Any place like that is where you will see the list of businesses, you know, that have joined or paid or renewed an annual registration. So you can get a list of all of these businesses and then create the show me strategy of just sending them what you can do. Because again, it didn't take you but 30 minutes. So if you just did this, week one, let me create two niche-based videos per day. By the end of seven days, that's 14 videos, right? You can go back in and edit those so they don't count against your render and download ones with that particular uh, customer's name in it or whatever you wanted to put in it, okay? And use that as your repertoire to start sending these out to these customers to let them know your skill set. Does that make sense, guys? Is, is that something that you guys can use? 
it's, yeah. it's absolutely brilliant, man. I, I just I'm blown away by this. And and it's pretty interesting because uh um you know this happens on GoDaddy quite a bit. You you register a domain name and all of a sudden you have 10 people hit you up if you don't you know privatize it or whatever. So here this that's exactly what this is is the 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 governments are giving us the businesses that we're able to you know reach out to and and but we're not just we're not just saying bye 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 we're showing them we're giving them hey look at this video header that I created for your business. It's brilliant. Right. So someone said send the video out how um, typically with, with every business that's uh, in here, they will have an email address that they registered with. Okay. So that's how you would send the video out. You could create a landing page really easily uh, and send them a link to that landing page with their logo in it or what have you. Again, being that we're uh, uh, going after local businesses, eh, trip down to the, to the local business isn't a bad thing for those people who don't mind uh, interaction, you know, public interaction with, with, with the business. Otherwise you can keep it on the stealth side and do it from an email piece, but understanding that you have to build up some cred credibility from an email standpoint uh, in order for them to open that email. Uh, so again, it's, this is your research point. This is how you do your research and development. You get these names, you look on Facebook, you try to find out if they've already had something available. But because you know that they're local and that you're local, that's your your tie in. Hey, yeah, I'm right around the street from you. And you start throwing things that are relevant to that area. That's why local to local uh, business marketing is so much easier than it is online, because I have to prove that I'm not a bad guy online. But if I'm local, it's, it's like, hey, I trust that guy a little bit more just because hey, he's right around the corner from me. Yep. And, and what's cool now is once you get the, the relationship going and some of you are asking, how do I show it? I actually put it onto a, a Facebook fan page and I send them that. OK, that's exactly what you, you want to do. Once once you have that relationship, though, the referral is where you want to go next. OK, you literally once you get the deal and you have it, whether you go this route or you go the route I showed you yesterday with, you know, creating it and sending the video header just by somebody off the fly or the one we did today with the travel agency. Once you get that deal, now it's a matter of asking that travel agency or that real estate agent or that new business. Hey, who do you know that has a Facebook fan page that would love to have the same deal that I gave you um, that you could introduce me to? Referrals are one of the most powerful ways to get business. Okay. It just is guys. Um, the, the, the people, when somebody sends me to a referral, I pretty much am going into that with a hundred percent mindset of I'm getting a deal done. Bottom line, no question about it. And what's great is now that you have that person sending you uh, to one of their friends, they've just, and this is psychological stuff. What they've just done is solidified deep inside of them a foundational belief in you and their commitment to your business because they're giving you to their friends. They're sharing you with their friends. And that's where you're able to come in and sell your other stuff because the easiest person to sell is an already existing customer. Okay. If that customer is referring you to their friends, they've just deeply integrated themselves into believing in you at a high level that they will buy your other stuff. And that's where your website design, your social media management, the other softwares that you've purchased from Todd Gross and Matt Bush and, and, and all the other guys out there, <coughs> all of those things come into play. Would you agree with that, Charles? Is that, is that kind of how, I, I know you work off referrals as well. Um, you know, is that your concept as well? Absolutely. That's why when I was talking about earlier, the, the, the three or four things that you need to set up before you, you know, launch your business is having a referral program. Uh, because again, if you can make it easy for someone to say, hey, man, this guy did an awesome job for me, uh, type of a scenario where they give you access to their circle of influence, then it grows your business exponentially and cheaply without question. Yeah, perfect. OK, so here's what I want to do. All right. A lot of questions are coming in and I'm going to answer all these questions. Charles, you feel free to answer any of the questions as well. Yep, yep. Here's what I want to do for all of you. All right. We had an amazing session yesterday. It was a marathon. Today's a pretty good one. It's not going to be quite a little over two hours like, like yesterday was. 
Um, it's a, in both. We're going to have both replays. We're going to send them out to you guys. Here's what I want to do. All right. I know a lot of you are already coming to our advanced training starting tomorrow. Tomorrow starts our force you to success pro Facebook training. Okay. I'm going to go over all of that. I'm going to go over everything that we're going to be doing over the next two days. Now we're going to kick things up a notch. This was a part of our launch of Canvas. Okay. The price of this now has already gone up, but I'm going to do something special for everybody. Starting tomorrow and Thursday, I am going to take those of you that want to take advantage of this to a whole nother level. We are going to do stuff that you have never seen before. This is literally a two-day event that was part of our funnel. It was the OTO2. Many of you on here have already signed up for it. But what I want to do is I want to give those of you that were not able to sign up for it or just didn't know what was going on or just really didn't even know us at that time, the opportunity to take advantage of this amazing deal. What I'm going to do is I'm going to show you how to run Facebook video ads. Okay. Facebook video ads are one of the most powerful ways to generate business right now online. Not only because video is the hottest thing out there, but because they're dirt cheap. I'm going to show you how to run video ads for three cents, two cents, one penny per video view. I'm going to show you how to do that. I'm going to show you the most effective ways to do that. Okay. And on top of that, here's the key. I'm going to show you how to create custom audiences inside of Facebook. And those of you that don't know what that is right now, don't worry about it. I'm going to show you exactly how to do this. What a custom audience is in a nutshell is basically kind of like an email list. You know how the, the, the top guys always say the money's in the list? Well, what Facebook allows you to do is create these lists of people that you're able to remarket to on Facebook. I'm going to show you how to do that in your local market so you can dominate your local market with Facebook ads promoting your service. And I'm literally going to give you an ad that you can use that I used during the launch of Canvas with massive success. I sold over a hundred um, uh, people on buying through this Facebook video ads, a hundred in, in a week's time, one hundred people in one week, literally, because I use these strategies that I'm going to be teaching you over the next two days. Okay. I'm going to show you how to really cash in on what we have right now at our fingertips. These businesses have money. We just went through the holidays. We just went through it. Their busiest time of the year. They have money to invest in their business. And I'm going to show you how to capitalize on it. Then I'm going to take you one step further. I mentioned to you numerous times that I'm in the real estate video niche. I've been doing it since 2005. I know this niche in and out. I'm one of the leading providers with real estate video in the nation. I have the number one video marketing platform for real estate in the country. Um, I know what I'm doing here, okay? I'm going to show you how to work with a real estate agent and or brokers in your local market to literally monopolize your whole local market. These real estate agents and brokers know stuff that you don't realize that they know and they can connect the dots quick for you. I'm going to show you how to do that. All right. This is going to be a jam packed two days. On top of that, on top of that, I'm going to give you an extra 500 renders. Okay. Plus. Plus, I'm going to honor the same deal that I honored during the launch, only because you guys were all a part of the launch, okay? Right now, if you go to JVZoo, and I'm going to show you, this is $197. It is. I'm going to show it to you in just a second. I'm going to honor the same thing, the same deal that I did during the launch. I'm going to give you an extra 500 renders. If you sign up today, you have to sign up today because it starts tomorrow. There's no scarcity thing. I'm not trying to pull your leg or whatever. We're doing this tomorrow at three o'clock live. That's it just is. So you're going to get a total of 1,000 extra renders because you know what? Over the next two days, we're going to be creating some video headers and we're going to be making some sales. I'm going to show you how to do this. It's called force you to success. Okay, let me just show you real quick what I'm talking about. Here's what's going on. If you go to um, right now, if you go to JVZoo to our launch, 
okay? If you can actually go there to the launch pages, all right? This, this isn't false. This is real deal. This is the page that you guys were all taken to. This is the actual page right here, okay? The force you to success. Right now, anybody on JV Zoo that any of the marketers that are still promoting, anybody out there that's doing this, they have to pay $197 now. But because you were a part of the launch, and because you came to the, the past two days of getting started, what I'm literally going to do is I'm going to log into the system right now and I'm going to change the price for you. Okay. You have to do this now. Okay. There's, I, I, I'm sorry. It's not like I'm uh, uh, trying to scarcity thing or whatever. You literally, we're going to go right now to dropmock.com. Okay. Dropmock.com forward slash. And I'm going to put this in the, in the chat box real quick. Canvas success. Okay. And I'm going to show you, let me just show it to you real quick. All right. We're going to go there. And when you get there, um, you literally, it's, you're going to see when you get there, it's going to be $197. It's canvas force you to success. 1000 renders $197. Okay. I'm going to log in right now to the platform and I'm going to change the price right here in front of you. And I'm going to honor the $97 price point that we did during the launch. Only because you guys were all a part of the launch. You came to the trainings. You showed me that you're serious. I'm going to log in right now. I'm, I'm diving into it right now and I'm going to show you. All right. So here we are in the back office of our system. Okay. Let me go down here and I'm going to change the price right now. All right, and I'm going to scroll down. And what's going to happen as soon as you purchase, see this right here, Canvas Force You to Success, it's automatically going to add you to our webinar for tomorrow. So you'll be automatically added to come tomorrow at three o'clock as soon as you purchase. So let me save the changes. Okay, and I'm going to send this out to everybody right now. All right, let me go ahead and send this out. First off, before I do, let me just double check it and make sure that we're right. So Canvas, let me refresh the page. And make sure it is correct. There it is, $97. Okay, go ahead and click on that link. And let me go over what you're going to get again real quick here. This is phenomenal. Charles, real quick, what do you think about this deal, man? You think I'm a nut job or are we good with this? Dude, man, you, 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 uh, Jamie, we're going to have to have a meeting after, after this, man. Um, <laughs> no, seriously, though. No. Take, take advantage of him before he comes to his senses. Ah, uh, well, listen, when I did that during the launch, literally everybody's like, no, you don't want to do it for $97 because I charge anywhere from $197 to uh, $497 for my trainings, okay? I want you guys to succeed with Canvas. I know you can, but a lot of us need a little bit of a push. A lot of us need a little bit more education. We just gave you a lot of great stuff over the past two days. It's great content, great stuff. You know you can do it. You know you can create canvas video headers and get it out in the marketplace. What I want to do is I want to take you and I want to, I want to help you over the next two days, jumpstart your business. It's going to be tomorrow at three o'clock and Thursday at three o'clock. And we're literally going to work together. And here's what we're going to do. I'm going to go in and I'm going to start creating Facebook video ads. I'm going to show you live with our account here at Dropmock. I'm going to be creating Facebook video ads and I'm going to be selling Facebook video headers. Okay, I'm going to be doing it with you. Okay, I'm going to show you how to capture that local market and a custom audience. It's going to be sick. When you see some of you have been on some of my Facebook trainings before and you know what I teach, this stuff is gold. All right, it's absolute gold because these lists are extremely valuable. You can use these lists over and over and over again. You don't have to just sell them Facebook video headers. Once you get the ad going and you get this custom audience, now you can sell that same audience with another Facebook ad, your social media services, another software program that comes out, your website design services, any other services you have at any time, you can go back into Facebook, put a $5 bid in, a $10 bid in, and start generating new business for your company with what I'm going to teach you over the next couple of days, Okay. From there, what we're going to do is I'm going to show you how to take what's going on with these businesses and, and get them to invest that cash with your company. 
Then I'm going to show you how to utilize the real estate agents and the brokers in your local market to dominate, to literally dominate that local market real fast. These agents and brokers are so connected, you just don't understand. And then on top of that, I'm literally going to honor the same deal I did on launch where we were given 500 renders and then a bonus 500 renders for the launch. I honestly, I should not give the extra 500 renders. I shouldn't because that was for launch. But I thought about it and thought about it and thought about it. And I said, listen, all of you were a part of the launch and most of you came here and you don't know me. You didn't know us. You didn't know Drop Mock. You didn't know Charles. So I want to give you the benefit of the doubt that you gave us a chance to train you over the past couple of days. And now you got to know us, like us, and trust us a little bit more. So I'm going to go ahead and do that same thing and give you a total of 1,000 extra renders. But here's what I need you to do. For me to give you that extra 500, I need you to add your Zaxa transaction ID into the chat box. Okay. So all of you that are buying right now, I need you. You're going to get an email. And in that email, it's going to have a Zaxa transaction ID. I want you to add that to the chat box so we know that you're in. And then what we're going to do is um, you're, you're, you're automatically logged in to the GoToWebinar. But um, let's see here. I got it. Okay, hold on. Let me see. It's coming in fast here. Okay, I got you, Elizabeth, Paul, Chuck, Dean, Oswin, Pamela. Fantastic. Uh, Barbara, yes, you can. Okay, yes. Go ahead. Johan, gotcha. Sam, gotcha. <laughs> I'll, I'll accept the extra 500. Cynthia, I gotcha. Ray, I gotcha. Fantastic. Gotcha, Geneva. Gotcha, Jillian. Gotcha, Karen, Erica. Fantastic. Gotcha, Ray. Wonderful, wonderful, wonderful. Jillian, uh, can I put the purchase link in again? Yes, hold on, Shonda. Shonda, sorry. Dorothy, I'll wait for you. Don't you worry. <laughs> I know. I want to sit there too. You're going to love this training. It's so much. Listen. Quick question, Jamie. Yo. Uh, David wanted to know, and I think we should clarify about rollover capability for the renders. Uh, there is no rollover capabilities for the renders. It's 20 a month. It's 100 a month for uh, Canvas Elite, and they do not roll over. It just, just starts fresh. <clears throat> Joyce is asking, is this for real estate only? No, 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 no. I'm only going to bring the real estate twist into it because I know how to jumpstart you with that. It's not, it's for any business niche whatsoever. Good, good question. Sonia, I got you. Randy, I got you. Susan, I got you. Michael, got you. Renee, I got you. Okay, Robert, I got you. Lynn, you're in. Fantastic. Sorry, I don't want to miss, I don't want to miss a thing. Even when I dream of you, come on, Charles. <laughs> there goes the barbershop quartet routine. <laughs> oh man, that's so funny. Uh, no, you do not have to be Canvas Elite, Grady. You can come to this training even if you're not a Canvas Elite. You still have to purchase. Uh, so, a thousand renders. Can we use them? In yes. Great call, Pamela. <clears throat> so, the thousand renders is a one-time upgrade in your account. We actually have to manually do that, okay? We manually have to go in and add those to your account, and it's one time. So you're going to have those 1,000 one time, and that's it. So if you're on the main account, you'll have your 20 a month plus your 1,000 extra. We'll, we'll start pulling from the 1,000, okay? And then um, at any time, let's say you get to 988, 965, nine, and then you get down to 80. We, we pull from that, and it's 1,000. Once those 1,000 are gone... You know, they're, they're, they're over. They're not a monthly thing, but great question, Pamela. Uh, but listen, the reason I did a thousand is because I want it to be obscene. I wanted you guys to know, every one of you to know, wow, I don't have, we're going to go in here and we can create video header after video header after video header, and we can succeed at massive levels with these renders. You, we literally can create video after video after video and niche after niche after niche like that travel one. When I created that travel one for George up there in Egan, Minnesota, MN, well, it got me thinking, wow, if, and I'm just going to, George, I'm going to give away the gold here. If all George did was focus on travel in the whole state of Minnesota and just went through all the travel agencies he could find and just duplicate that template that he just did over and over and over again for all the different travel agencies, he could sell a ton of those things. It's incredible. 
<laughs> Denny says, do not sing, Jamie. All right, hold on. <laughs> hold on, hold on. Let me see how you boot somebody from a webinar. <laughs> oh, that's awesome. <laughs> Dale, those thousand renders, they never expire. Okay, those thousand renders will be in your account until you use them all up. Great question. Got you, William. You are in. Alan, I got you. Brian, I got you. Jim, I got you. No, no, yeah. So, David, yeah, they, 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 they're in your account until you use them. I'm in, says Brian. Yes. Yeah, so, 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 don't have rollovers. What happens to the thousand renders each month? The, okay, let me clear that up. So, everybody's asking that now. The thousand renders will be in your account indefinitely until you use them all up. Your other renders, which are your twenty or your hundred, based off the package you're on, those are the only ones that refresh each month. They do not roll over. Pamela says, woohoo. Absolutely. So think about it like, like this. If you've got a store, you're stocking your shelves with merchandise. We just gave you a thousand pair of shoes to sell up front in your store. Is this a female store or a male store? Uh, female. They buy more shoes. <laughs> okay, good. <laughs> <laughs> Absolutely. Got you, Mark. So got you, Jane. Got you, Rick. Got you, Erica. Fantastic. Don't forget about the 10 free bonuses. Yes. Yeah, so oh, Todd, we're we're taking care of that. That's a good, good point, dude. Good, good point. We're taking care of that, man. Give me one second. Let me take another hit of my water here. Hey Susan, we'll take a look at that. Uh Jamie, we've got someone who's trying to purchase, but it's saying it can't process her payment right now. Oh, okay. Um hit us in support. As well, Susan, go into drop mock, hit us in support. And uh, Martin, or so we'll, we'll definitely get you taken care of. Don't you worry about it. I got you, Nikki. I got you, Brian. Got you, Perry. Okay. Where do I send the Zach's? Right here, Richard. Uh, where you just type that in. Type that in there as well. Uh, <laughs> Dean says, yeah, the 1,000 bonus is awesome the, for the renders. I have it, and I'm creating demos as fast as I can. Kenneth, I got you. Joyce, I got you. Royal, I got you. Rebecca, Susan, fantastic. Brian, you're in. I got it during the launch, says Michelle. Congratulations. That's all. Awesome. Listen, uh, I only got 500 renders on launch day. Ron, listen, dude, I'm going to take care of you. I'll, I'll check out your account. We'll make sure you're good. That's my buddy Ron that I was telling you guys about earlier. Okay, I got you, Sharon. Good job, Perry. I got you. Woo! Oh, never mind. I felt okay, Ron. I got you, dude. I so until we reach a thousand, we did not. Uh, no, you still need the, no, 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 Stuart. Do you understand Canvas Elite? You get 10 brand new video templates every single month. Okay, so it's not just the renders on, on Canvas Elite, you get 10 brand new exclusive video headers that you can use with the commercial license as well with the Canvas Elite, which is huge. Okay. Safety in numbers. <laughs> okay, I got you, George. You're in. Geneva says, I have shoes, Charles. <laughs> I know, because you bought them. <laughs> <laughs> From Charles's store. EDI Clement, I got you. All right, you dudes are hilarious, says William. <laughs> I don't, we're just having some fun. You rocks is Todd. Thank you, Todd. I appreciate it, dude. Do you get me, Jamie? I don't know what, what, am, what am I getting, Kenneth? Hold on. Let me see if I missed something. Let me see. I think I missed something, Kenneth. Actually, no, I'll just say, yeah, I get you, man. <laughs> uh, I, okay. Great question, David. I can't do the next two days. Membership replay. So, David, um, basically what will happen is, Inside of Dropmock, we have a mastermind area. In that area is all of, is or are. I don't know what you, Charles is our linguist. Is, <laughs> you, you'll have an area where you can go in and watch the replays. So you will have indefinite access to that area. Okay. Okay, Robert, I got you. I'm in, says EBI. Hey, my prior request was law. Hey, about that. Carmen. Okay, Richard, just hit us in support, and uh, we'll take care of you. Richard, Todd Hunter, we'll take care of you, buddy, okay? 
Okay, Barry, I got you. Link, please. Okay, hold on one second, Shonda. I thought I added it in there again, but let me just try one more time. I'll send it to you individually, Shonda, um, as well, to see if you can get it. And I'll send it to all there, and then I'll send it to all here as well and see if you guys get it. All right, Gary, I have you. Okay, Rich Dabney, I, I see that you put it, but I don't see the, the number. Two, but kept trying. Okay, so I guess... There's a lot of people buying because Richard or Mark is having the same issue. Got me, Roscoe. Roscoe P. Coltrane. Zaxa is crashed. Oh, that's awesome. <laughs> <laughs> will advanced training be recorded? Yes, Brian, it will be recorded. Uh, Ian, I gotcha. Richard, I gotcha. Can you please do the same for me, please? Yeah, Raj, do me a favor and hit me in support. Go to Drop Mock. Go to the bottom right. Let me just show you guys. What you need yeah, show, to do. show them where it is. Yep. <clears throat> so if you look down here in the bottom right corner, just come here. Any of you are that having the challenges right now, come here to support. Just let us know you're having challenges, and we'll do everything we can to get you in uh, before we start the training at three o'clock tomorrow. Okay, Deborah, gotcha. William, you're in. Uh, site. Okay. Uh, site doesn't let me go to where the render. Hmm. Hit me in support, Chuck. Fantastic. Brian, I love it. Brian got it during launch. Debbie says, I'm in. Amanda. Okay. Mr. Uh, Todd I, Hunter. Good, I got you, dude. Go ahead, hey, Charles. Uh, yeah, uh, Amanda, check your uh, the chat box. I'll just put something in there uh, for you personally. So let me know if you got it. Where do we check to see our render count? Oh, okay, Darren, let me show you real quick here. So Darren's asking, where do we check to see our render count? What you do is you come up here to your profile right here. And you click on profile and then inside your profile, you're going to see your canvas renders right here. Remaining canvas renders 94. Okay. That's what I have right now. Look, I'm doing the training and they won't even give me the renders. What the heck is going on around here? Man. Oh man. I don't know what is happening. Aaron, I gotcha. Uh, no, Mickey, if you already purchased the OTO to force you to success training during the launch, you're already added to the go-to webinar and do not purchase again. You don't have to, okay? Uh, all I'm doing right now, Mickey, is when a lot of new people come to meet Drop Mock due to launches because of our marketing partners, Todd Gross, Matt Bush, uh, whoever who invited you here to meet us because of Canvas, we have relationships with all these marketers and they, they, they work with us and, and Karthik, Uzine, Martin Crumlish, all of them, you know, all the great guys out there that, that are creating stuff promoted us and you came to Drop Mock for the first time and you don't know us. So a lot of people are like, I'm not spending a hundred dollars. I just want this canvas thing. So what I got to thinking about, I'm like, you know what, what I'm going to do is we're going to train them for two days on getting started. And then they're, they're going to get to know us. And realize that we're just good guys having fun and, and want to want to work with you and train you and, and, and help you succeed with this. So I said, all right, I'm going to go ahead and honor what we did during the launch. Only for the people that were a part of the launch. Everybody else, everybody else has to go to JV Zoo. You guys are getting this, <laughs> this special link that I'm setting up. Everybody else from the marketers, they have to go to JV Zoo right now. And they have to pay $197 dollars. $197 for the same thing you're getting right now because I appreciate you guys coming to all these trainings, okay? All right, Debbie, thank you. Uh, we'll check on that. Uh, Sonia, hit us in support. Had to leave while, what's the cost for the thousand renders? Owen, basically what we're doing is uh, if you check out this link right here, uh, it's going to take you uh, to our training. I'll go over it one more time here. Um Okay, Frederick, I got you. <laughs> Just pulled off the road, says Terrence. Here's my Zaxa. That's awesome. What about Eugene? We wouldn't forget Eugene. We got you there, man. Uh, Erica says, you make it very easy to be a success. You know what? One of my very first emails was, everybody, and I don't know if it's still available or not. I don't even know if they're still in. The letter U, the letter R, the letter A, success at Juno. Dot com. You are a success at Juno.com. I do believe each and every one of us, we are a success. Where we're at right now, we are a success. Think about, all, well, I don't, I could go off on a big tangent right now, but I'm not going to because we'll be on here another half hour. 
Geneva said, I love shoes. <laughs> Pablo, go ahead and do what you got to do and then hit us in support. We'll take care of you. All right. So Jessica says, what do we get for the 97? Let me, let me show you. Good, good question. Cause um, got a couple people asking. All right. So basically what you're going to do, Jessica, is you're going to get an extra two days with me. But what I call this, it's called force you to success pro Facebook training. All right. You have the ability right now to create these Canvas video headers. What I'm going to do now is I'm going to show you how to start running Facebook video ads, not just regular ads, Facebook video ads that you can push out there. I'll show you how to create regular ads as well, but I want to focus on video ads. I'm going to show you how to do that, right? More importantly, I'm going to show you how to focus that into your local market so you can capture that local market into a custom audience. All right. A custom audience is basically a list on Facebook that you can market to over and over again. So you're going to be creating this list of people on Facebook in your local market that want to buy stuff from you. Then you sell them a, a, a video header. And then on top of that, now, let's just say two weeks from now, you come up with another promotion for your website design, your social media services, your other stuff that you do. And you run a different ad with the skills I'm going to teach you tomorrow and Thursday for that service to that same list. Okay. It's very, very powerful stuff. I'm going to show you how to do that. On top of that, I'm going to show you how to take advantage of all, not, I don't want to say take advantage in a bad way because it's not, it's a, it's in a good way. You're taking advantage of the fact that these businesses have a lot of money right now to invest. We need to show these businesses that they need to invest it into Facebook marketing, not radio, TV, news, and all that stuff that they're doing now, or at least allocate a portion of that to Facebook marketing. Facebook is where everybody's at and it's paid to play. These businesses have Facebook fan pages, but they forgot that they, they've basically put their Facebook fan pages to the side. I'm going to show you how to reignite that. Then I'm going to show you how to monopolize the mo local market by using relationships you have or to get a relationship with a local real estate agent or broker. This training is not a real estate training. It's all encompassing of any niche. I'm just going to show you a part of this, how to focus on a real estate agent broker to help you uh, skyrocket what you're up to. And then on top of that, you're going to get the extra 500 renders and I'm still going to honor the extra 500 for doing it during launch for a total of 1,000 extra renders. On JVZoo right now, the price is $197. I'm going to honor our price of $97 during launch. I'm honoring that today on this webinar. Okay? As long as you put your Zaxa transaction ID in there. And those of you that are having a challenge, I will still honor that uh, for you. Just hit us in support. Um, I know you're having challenges. He's uh, bananas. He's bananas. He's bananas. Yeah. Yes, 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 yes. Link, please. I'm Shonda, 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 I'm trying to get the link to you. Um, let me send it privately again. I'm, I've, I've sent it. If you can look in the chat box, Shonda. Okay, Leroy, I got Oh, Shonda got it. Okay. All set. Uh, Zaxa. Mar Mary says, all right, Charles and Jamie, I'm in. Start selling these videos. Uh, Joe, you're going to want to talk to somebody about that. I would. Great. Webby, Jamie, thanks. See you tomorrow. Annette, thank you. See you tomorrow. It would be worth buying again. To get it another. David says, what do you think of this? It would be worth buying again to get another 1,000. That's 240 renders a year. Also, well, well, David, that's a, that's a, that's up to you, man. I, I, I'm not going to push that out to everybody, but I understand what you're saying. I totally get what you're saying. Actually, I don't want to push that out to everybody. <laughs> <laughs> Do not, under any circumstances, push that. Yeah. <laughs> He's you gaming the system. Not. Okay. Uh, right there, Roscoe, where you just typed that question in, where do I put my Zaxa? Put it in the same spot. Javits has already got it. Good. All right, Larry, I appreciate that. Pamela, I'll see you tomorrow. Gotcha, Richard. You're in. Uh, the uh, Let's see here. Brian, hit us in support. We'll get that taken care of as far as your renders. I'm in. I'm in, says Owen. All right. I'm really excited about this, guys, and have been in the game for a while. Awesome, Jillian. This is going to be great. Cool. I signed up. 
initially for the training? Yes, sir, you do. Uh, yeah, Dominic, Canvas Elite is something separate. Canvas Elite is our monthly template club, basically, is what most people call it, uh, where we give you 10 brand new video headers every single month from our designers. Okay. Perfect. 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 Okay. I don't know where my Patricia, it's probably in your email. Uh, love your teaching style and energy. Thank you, Richard. I appreciate that. I did not receive a Zaxa receipt, Thomas. I got you, Doug. I'm in. Okay. Perfect. Um, you should get an email or maybe on the page that you landed on. Uh, how much you check the page that you landed on as well, Richard? It might, uh, or I'm sorry, uh, Thomas. Uh, how much is Elite? <laughs> the Elite program is, um, I believe the price is up on that as well now, but uh, I'd have to check on that one. I, I don't know if the top of my head where we're at with the pricing on that, Chuck, but um, if any of you want to take advantage of that, just let me know and support. And we'll definitely honor honor that just over the next two days as we go through the the uh, main training, this uh, force you to success training. And then I have to stop the discounting launches over and we're, we're in the mainstream now. But uh, if any of you want to take advantage of that, I'm not trying to sell elite right now. I really want to I want to get you guys out there hustling and making money is what I want to do. Yes, of course. I think it makes total sense for you guys to buy elite. No question about it. But that's as. Uh, Henry, yes, sir. I am very much so. Uh, uh, David, I gotcha. Having problems purchasing. Um, Dale, just hit us in support. We'll take it. absolute good care of you. Fantastic, Bob. Thank you, sir. I'm having problems, says Ellen. Yeah, a lot of people are having problems, Ellen. So if you're having problems with Zaxa, just come to support inside of Dropbox. Let me show you one more time. Hold on one second here. Inside of support here, um, inside of Dropbox, down here in the right corner, just hit us here saying you're having a tough time getting in with Zaxa, and we'll do everything we can to get you in before tomorrow starts, okay? Okay, got you, Patricia. With the promotion code on, you just said it went. Uh, yeah, hold on, let me see how I can do that, Claudia or Dominic. Hold on one second. Let me write that down. I don't have a easy way of doing that. So let me just, Claudia, let me read that over one more time because I'm, I don't know if I got that right. One second. One second. Hold on. Uh, can you send me an email with the person in honor what you promised? Jamie just said it. Why not? Yes, Dominic. Uh, okay, I'll take care of that. Okay. Okay. Yes, 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 yes. Okay. So, Charles, do you have any parting words for our fine feathered friends? <laughs> absolutely get rest get rest rest the body rest the mind because uh we're really trying to get more and more people successful in 2018 it is so many stories that we hear from you guys uh that you've been in the game for a minute but you really haven't been able to turn a profit um and we're not really out here selling dreams to people we're selling action and if you're willing to take action, you're going to make it in 2018. And we're going to be behind you all the way. No question. That's exactly, you know what? I appreciate that, Charles, because that's exactly it. But I'm good. Uh, and I'm going to, I'm going to shoot straight with everybody right now. Um, those of you that just purchased and those of you that have purchased during launch, I'm just telling you these two days, I'm going to be bringing some heat. <laughs> You better be ready for it. I'm going to be bringing some juicy stuff. It's really, really good content, okay? And that's not a, a, a cockiness or anything like that. I just This is valuable, valuable skill sets that I'm going to be teaching you. A skill set that you're going to, whether you're doing Canvas or anything else, it's a skill set that you need to know for your business, okay? That being said, it is. It's vitally important that you understand you need to take action. What I'm going to be giving you, what I'm going to be bringing to you, it's all about taking action. And if you're not going to take action, you're wasting your money. 
Okay. Um, that's just to be transparent. I think that just came across rude and I don't mean it to be. I just want you to know if you're not willing to, to create video headers and do the things that I'm going to be telling you to do to reach out to these customers and, and contact them and follow up with them and, and all of the stuff I'm going to be showing you and, and building the ads and you, you need to be willing to invest $5 a day in, in running Facebook ads. If you're not willing to invest $5 a day in running Facebook ads, this training is not for you. Okay. So, it, you know, and I'm just being transparent. I'm not trying to be a, you know, a schmuck here or anything like that. I just want you guys to know that I, I, I take it for granted that you are coming to this and you are going to take action. So do me a favor in the chat box, give me a seven, seven, seven. If you know, I'm going to be, it's force you to success, which means I'm going to be forcing you to take action. And I want you to know, I want you to, you have to be coming to this thing to take action, right? Other than that, why do it? It's, it, I mean, yeah, we'll have a lot of fun. <laughs> Definitely no question, but uh, it's more than that. It's not about entertainment. It's about taking action and making money. That's why we're here. Our kids want to eat food every day. I don't know why that's the part of the process, but every single day they wake up and say, could you feed me? And I'm like, man, what is going on here with these kids? So we have to do something to make money, right? Well, we have it at our fingertips. <laughs> we have it. At, that was a bit extreme, but you get my point. Um <laughs> like Charles, some some of them are getting ready to go to college, you know. So we, we, have to, we have to make some money here. And that's what it's all about. All right. William says, I'm bringing some popcorn. You better have some some uh some butter, okay? All right, so let's do this. I know and I have some bad kids, says Jillian. Oh my gosh, that's funny. All right, Charles Earls, I got you, man. Everybody, thank you. So very much. Um, I'm going to give you one last shout out. Um, is there anybody else that wants to get in before we go ahead and log off? Just put a me in the chat box or hold your horses in the chat box. And I'll go ahead and extend it just a little bit longer. But if not, um, we've been on here a couple hours and I want to go ahead and respect your time. Uh, I want you guys on this training, but if, if not, if it's not the right time for you, uh, no issue. Okay, Harold. Oh, Howard, I'm sorry. Gary, go ahead. Tony, go ahead. Uh, I'll go ahead and give it just a couple more times. Uh, Detlef, it's up to you, man. It's it's a different twist, but um, you've been on some of my Facebook before, Detlev. Uh, so uh, it's, it's a different twist because I'm going to be focused on uh, video headers in this training. So it's up to you if you want to you participate or not. Um, but you you... Yeah, I, I, it's it's a tough one. As a sales guy, I'm going to say yes, but at the same time, all I'm what I'm doing, Getlev, is I'm 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 taking and I'm focusing all my attention on Canvas for this. Okay, it's a good question, El. Hey, 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 let me let me put a little a spin on that, Getlev. If you took action with the last one and you're running Facebook ads, no. If you didn't, join. Nice. Okay, check it out. How long were the it, um, okay, sorry, can't. Not a, not an issue. Not an issue. Available to per. Uh, okay, absolutely, no question, buddy. Listen, Detlev, you're you're our buddy, our homie, our amigo, our compadre, right? Detlev's been with me since the beginning. Yep. Okay, we'll check out support. Perfect. Okay, there was just a couple people still trying to get in there. Um, if you guys can do that. Yeah, the Facebook group, they're trying to get everybody in, Amanda. Okay, Tony, I got you. Perfect. Great job, dude. Uh, they are trying to get everybody into the Facebook group. Hey, Charles, look what yeah. Royal saying. Do you know what Club Ellery's is? Club Ellery's. I guess it's in Atlanta. Royal and his band is playing there. Oh, cool. There you go. <laughs> hey, Charles is a singer. <laughs> Not really. <laughs> Good night, Detlev. It's 11 15 for Detlev in Germany on Campbellton Road. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah. I, I know exactly where that is. <laughs> I will see if me and the missus can, uh, can get out. Quick, make the band a video. That's awesome. Yeah, absolutely. You know, your Facebook fan page needs a video header. Will there be an update when the color templates come out? Absolutely. Freddie, every time we make a, an update, we're going to be sending some stuff out. Um, it's going to be good, okay? 
Uh, Tony, hit us in support. We'll take care of you about the commercial license. Royal says, I'll be on the keys. All right. So once again, thank you all so very much. The past two days, getting to know you, uh, just sharing with you and going through the getting started of Canvas. I'm so excited. I'm more excited now than when we started this project because it's such an amazing tool. And you all see now how simple it is to use, create a folder, find the business, grab your assets, bring it into the system, render it, send it to them. And it's that simple. So thank you all so very much on behalf of all of our, all of our family here at Dropmock. We appreciate you. We thank you so much for investing in Canvas. And if you need anything, we are here to serve you. That is our job. Our job is to serve you and help your business succeed with our tools. If you need anything, let us know. We will absolutely take care of you. I thank you all so much for, for trusting us and putting your faith into our company. And we look forward to working with you throughout 2018. Those of you that jumped on board the Force You to Success training, I will see you tomorrow at 3 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Everybody have a wonderful evening and take care. Absolutely. And Ellery's needs some video content on their website. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>